You got to have that yet praise. So I add this to the song. This is what I want y'all to say and tell the enemy. In spite of all you're doing, Oh, I thank you now. 
I praise you. When I got up this morning, I got up with a praise in my mouth. Thank you. Glory to you, man. May not have all I desire to have, but thank you. May not be where I want to be, but thank you. I give you praise. I glorify you. I magnify you. In Jesus' name we pray. In the name of Jesus. Church, you ought to help me. In the name of Jesus. And the church said, Amen. 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 Come on, give God some praise. I didn't say you need no praise. I said give God some praise. Somebody ought to give God some praise. We ought to hold to his hand. Oh, yeah. And if you get the weak and all the way, ask him to hold your hand. Yes, and he'll never let you down.
pray that uh, you continue praying that the Lord would help us uh, in his word. And I'm not going to hold you long. And I, got, I know I got two or three well able uh, people that can stand right now and, and do us just our just reward. And uh, I'm grateful to have that in my presence this morning. Um, and I almost like King Agrippa. I would tell the devil he a liar. I, I would not claim what he placed on me. Amen. But I'm not ignorant that there's some things I have to do also to keep things intact. And I, I thank God for my wife because I was really messed up this week. Offer her plans that she couldn't go because uh, this blood level dropped so much. Wow. Well, I thank God oh, yeah. that He's able. Mm -hmm. I got a preacher here, preacher there, I'm preacher there. Yes, sir, uh, uh, let's pray with us that uh, we can be helped because of when the word go forth, yes, sir. Uh, we all can be. Very familiar parable in the book of Matthew, uh, chapter 13. All right. And I'd like to read a few of uh, those verses commencing at verse 24. Uh-huh. And uh, they find these words. Another parable put he forth unto them, saying, The kingdom of heaven is likened to a man which sows some seeds in yes, the sir. field. Yes, sir. But while men slept, look, look now. his enemy came and sowed taff among the wheat yes, yeah. and went his way. But when the blaze was sprung up and brought forth fruit, uh -huh. then appeared taff also. Yes. So the servant of the householder came and said unto him, Sir, uh -huh. did it not thy souls good seeds in thy field? From whence then have it taft? Mm -hmm. And he said unto them, An enemy had done this. Enemy. And the servant said unto him, Will thou then that we go and gather them up? But he said, Nay, lest while you gather up the task, your root up also wheat with them. Yes, sir. Let both grow together unto the harvest. Yes, and in the time of harvest, uh, I will say to the reaper, gather ye together first the task, yes. and bind them and bond them to burn them. But gather the wheat into my barn. Oh, yeah. free, free. Amen. Amen. Free, free, free. Amen. We just want to talk briefly, just a, a few minutes to, from this stop on there uh, until the until the harvest come. Until the harvest come. Until the harvest come. I started on uh, last week um, at this. Um, Commence trying to talk about the identity of the church. All right. And it's very important that uh, uh, we know who we are. Yes, sir. And we know whose we are. Uh -huh. And the identity of the church is it, it, not what you say with your mouth. That's uh -huh. number one. Uh, it, it's more than a talk. Yeah, yeah, uh, it actually is a walk. Yes, yeah. Actually, it's a lifestyle. lifestyle. The second point, it just don't start on Sunday morning. Uh, identity crisis that we are in. Yeah. And, and, and you have to be prayed up that we don't overgo our boundaries yeah, yeah. with this identity pride. 
crisis that we live in. Because sometimes that we say and do things that don't line up with the word of God. And you can't line up with the word of God if you don't know it or if you just ignore it. Do you know that you can know the truth and sit there and ignore it at the same time? That causes a problem among the believers. And whenever those who or whether they in whatever stages they are, because we all on different levels. Amen. Uh, yeah, some of us are a little stronger than the others. Mm -hmm. But then you are, those are strong need to bear the affirmative of the weak. Right. We, 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 we need to help them. Yes, sir. I found out that a lot of people don't want progress. It's always in tune, but it's hard to get in on. Uh -huh. <laughs> and, and the reason why I say it unto the harvest is because if you are the individual that's sitting in the pews and you have made up your mind to follow Christ, mm -hmm. and, and he has adopted you as his children, uh -huh. his children. Yeah. That's the time you want to need his power. Yeah. Now, if you don't believe me, go to Ephesians 6, yes, and round 10 and 11, that you need his strength. That's right. You cannot be in this battle in your own strength. That's right. That's right. You, you can't do it. You cannot fight evil and the devil in your own strength. You can try, but you won't succeed. That's why it's very important to know who you are. A lot of people have accepted Christ and they have a lot of little incident to turn them back. A lot of people don't want to enter into the church houses no more. Because they said, it got so many identity crises, we don't know who is who. <laughs> when the word of God is supposed to be proclaimed, they're talking, uh, 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 yes, a prosperous gospel. Amen. Uh, claiming and, and all of this and naming and uh, uh, praise is this and praise it, and they are true. Mm -hmm. You ought to be able to praise God. Yes. But the Lord don't talk. Amen. You got to sacrifice when you're on this journey. You're going to run, you're going to meet, you're going to interact, you're going to be before the devil, and you can't fight him in your own. The worst place, but it's an uh, evidence they really there that we expect the devil to be on the outside. Uh -huh. Where is he, we, we expect the devil to be down the street. Oh, uh, with people that disarrange and have all disorganized and, and the smell tone not right. Uh, we, we, we think that's the devil. But, but you got some devil got on some. Yeah. Everlasting. Yeah. Oh, they got the Chanel on. Man. Yeah. They got the hat dipped to the side. Yeah. You got some devils in sheep clothes. Yeah. And, 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 and you can't judge folks. But whatever you judge on, it'll be judged back to you. Yeah. But there's a force of the devil. It's not judging. You cannot come in here and act like you're a Christian.
that's not fighting mm. Salem in the pulpit. Mm -hmm. That book is here. Yes, he is. Yeah. And he is here, yes, mm. unlegalized. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, preacher? That means that he is not here legal. Because he, he need legs. Come on. He need a body. Yeah. 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 And, 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 and the only way he can get here that some of us brought in him. Yeah. 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 <laughs> but I want to give you encouragement. <laughs> Quit looking at the one sitting beside you. Across the aisle from you. They don't have the power to overbind what the Lord has already in place. You can, you can look a person and tell them the truth, and, and you don't have to get loud. You don't have to use the other type of language. But you can face the devil with God help. Yeah. I want to stress this to my people. Too many people trying to deal with the devil in their own mind. Uh -huh. Or what they learned in the Bible. Or what they read of. Or whatever they had. Some type of language come from somebody that's not in Christ. You can't, you can't fight him. Mm -hmm. It got to be in you. Amen. The strength of God oh, yes. to face the devil. Oh, yeah. And you can do it without any your own strength. So many times that we try to confront him and they hit a button in us. Oh, and every last one of us got a button. Yeah. See, y'all quiet on the night. Yeah. But when you get in a conversation and somebody touch that button that you didn't see, yeah. them jokes will come across the aisle. Yeah. It'll be some language come from their mouth. But that's not Christian life. That's something you don't want to do. Because you a stumbling block for somebody sitting here looking to follow Christ as all of their life and you claim to be one thing and you something else. People tell them the lost one that know they ain't got no Christ said, come to church. <laughs> And they get here, and some of us acting like a nut. Amen. Amen. When they get here. Amen. And that's not right. Amen. But you can't fight them in your own strength. Mm -hmm. That's why those who call themselves children of God need to know Him for yourself. Right. The preacher got here, the deacon got them, the, some of the members got them, some of them don't have them. You can't stand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Listen, listen, listen. Listen what the power said. They, they said that we planted wheat. Mm -hmm. yes. And we know what we planted. Yes. <laughs> yes. But, but, but the idea is after they planted the wheat <laughs> and went to sleep uh -huh. and got up the next morning,
the household. <laughs> they, they consult the God. Should we go and pull up the tariff? Because we know we planted wheat there. Come on now. Christ like. Talk with the Lord about it. He said, nay. No. Yes. For your educator, he said, no. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. That's out of your league. To go and try to pull up the tag. Mm -hmm. What you don't know is that tag and we look alike. Mm -hmm. Help us today. Paint that picture out there. Well, if tag and we look alike, pull up the wrong thing, or what? Then when you go to pull tap, mm -hmm. you might be pulling wheat. All right. That's right. Yeah, right because yeah. wheat and tap look alike. Look alike. Yeah. Come on home with it. Mm -hmm. We sitting here, we all in this assembly. Yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. Look alike. Yeah, that's it, bro. <laughs> look alike. <laughs> Whatever you got on. And I ain't talking about nobody in rainbows, but I'm just trying to paint a picture. Mm -hmm. If we in time look alike, then how can you tell the wheat from the tag? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Hallelujah. All right. All right. Help me out. I'm going to come on right down that road. Uh -huh. Because, because, if we in time look alike, then somebody going to misjudge who I am. Some, somebody said he might be preaching he might look like we <laughs> but he might be tagged don't, don't you look funny at me because somebody will misjudge who you are if it's so what the Bible said that the weak and the tag look alike so that means you have to have a spirit discerning on what is we need to have. And you cannot do that on your own. We don't have to be dumbfounded, but we have to listen what the master of the house has to say. Oh, yeah. Because anytime there's something good or a good product is growing, mm. <laughs> then appear the tag. Amen. Did you notice what I read? Mm -hmm. The tag did not appear until the plant produced wheat. What, what, what are you saying? That when you sit there and don't be productive, then do it. That task will never come. But when you produce wheat, then appear the task. And when the task comes, he comes to sit up roadblock. Yeah. He come to sow disbelief. Uh -huh. He come to sow negative to get you to turn from right to wrong. Oh yeah, right, Pastor. Have you noticed that? Oh yeah. Have you know folks that go to the same church you go, hmm. and they'll talk about folks in the same church you go. <laughs> they'll try to run folks from the church, and they don't go nowhere. Pretty fast. Uh, 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 am I in the right house? It's true. Right it's true. And some of you sit there and heard this and listen to this. Amen. And no, it ain't nothing right about it. Amen. What a word, What the master. 
did not have the audacity to heal the word of God and change. We got communion. <laughs> yeah. We got communion. Mm. Yes. I, I got some sleep this week. <laughs> but it was disturbing. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Cause you you it disturbing cause you sit there quiet. She said, I brought you in this world, <laughs> and I'll take you out. Yes, and she went on by five to me. <laughs> After seeing that, I know what not to do. Oh, yeah. I was like Sam, I'll be quiet, let them suffer. But my point is, when you're trying to teach your children, mm -hmm. be careful what you say in the home. Oh, yeah. Because these little child get right up in your lap. And hear everything you say. Yeah. And it'll cut up all your confidence. Mm -hmm. We got some young people here with your church militant who are smart, who are intelligent. Mm -hmm. and, and I want to be able to be a part in cultivating to expand their growth to help somebody else. Amen. Amen. Now, uh, you can't take on what we already got here. No, but you can add on by your, yes, your interest in young people's and influence. Mm -hmm. uh, all of God can use all of us in a magnificent way. Yes. And we need to take heed of that. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. Allow the church to prosper. Not with money. I'm, I'm, I'm so glad I brought that up. I, I didn't want to say that. Because some people, because they pay money, they think they can rule in churches. I don't have to look at money. No, thank God. Let them people that over there do what they're supposed to do. I can get an amen. 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 You, you, you can't give a person a job and take it over and want to do it yourself. Isn't that right? Trust in the Lord in all thy way uh -huh. and lean not to your own understanding. That's faulty. Hmm. If you scandalize somebody's name and it's not true, them people are human just like you. Amen. Amen. Look at your child. Amen. Look at your son. <laughs> Will you want somebody to scandalize? Their name, and it ain't true with no proof. I take the word of God and I learn from all of you. Because I want to make it better in my life. Amen. That I may know how to treat somebody that fought along the way and don't judge them because of their standards or what they live or what they don't have. Treat them right. You got to know what right is. Amen. That's right. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. I'm going to solve it. Preach the word. Let me tell you something. All of you want to be prosperous in your life, read your word. Read your word. And do the wrong with the law that I give promotion. Not, not what you digging in or downing somebody else to move up. If, if you 
do what's right and pray to God. Yes. You don't have to uh uh yes, what the word to you? The the feast off the poor, yeah, and make them more poor and you become more wealthy. Amen. Like a dog eating dog. Yes. Mm. You don't have to do that. God been too good to you. Amen. And so what you have an idea that you want to open up a business up. Trust God. Amen. He said, if you abide in me and I abide in you, that you can ask whatever. Yeah. He won't only give you what you need. He'll give some of the stuff what you want. 